Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. My name is Ichwa and today's video what I have for you guys is a brand new method on how you guys can make money really quick in Grand Theft Auto 5 Online. So guys if you do want to enjoy this video, make, I'd really appreciate if you guys like and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this in the future. Here's a giveaway for you guys too. I mean thanks to everyone for 30k subscribers so here are the steps to enter so i'd really appreciate if you guys enter the giveaway too because it's for all of you guys and thank you for your support and here's a word from our sponsor and then we'll now guys if you head over to the playstation website and look for shotcuts you'll find there's a massive problem they are massively overpriced but at easylooting.com what you will find is they offer you the same money for just 20 times cheaper. Next thing, they also offer you modern cars, modern packages, modern outfits, and modern cars with anti van and full money back guarantee. Check out the reviews if you don't trust me. Now, if you guys want to check them out, the link is in the description down below. Use code GTROY for a 10% discount. Now, guys, to begin with today's video, it's very simple. First and foremost, what you will need is a car that you want to duplicate. For example, I honestly recommend you guys use the uh, you see this one right here you see so yeah future shock issue and also you'll need a fagio inside of any garage it doesn't really have to be the office garage you can have it inside of any garage it's as simple as that next thing that you will need is a moc and after that what you will need is moc with a personal vehicle storage obviously and then you'll need a leg rh8 in the back of your moc simple as that guys that's all the steps and requirements that you guys will need from this on this is completely solo so you guys don't have to worry about having friends or joining other people so yeah from here make your way over to the casino now i'm going to drive myself over to the casino and once you're at the casino the next thing that you want to do is go ahead and pull up the pause menu go to online and join rockstar creator now you're going to start up rockstar creator wait for yourself to load in now once you guys load in into the rockstar creator go ahead and click on quit to story mode now once you quit to story mode uh you will get three flashes after that once you get three flashes, press and hold the psn button and then go ahead and join free uh a survival on anything so if your friends in a survival join him or else you can just join a random survival of the menus on the ps5 screen so yeah so once what once that happens you'll you load into a survival and this is what's gonna happen so once you join in next thing that you want to do is quit the job as soon as possible from there make your way over to your car wherever your car is and then go ahead and just find your car because as you can see i'm kind of stuck and can't find my car over here so yeah that's kind of a bummer but what i'll do is find my car and make my way over back to the casino and guys this is really really important because if you did this correctly what's going to happen you'll notice is that uh, the casino will be the old casino this won't be the new casino that you guys already know of. this will be the old well, the old casino before diamond casino arrives as you can see this is the old casino right here so guys if you get the old casino that's really really good and you've done this step correctly next thing that you want to do is go to online and then find new session and start an invite only session now guys if you're on the playstation 4 or xbox do not you do not need to go ahead and find a new session guys what you will need to do is do it in the current session but i like to do it in a uh, in a new private session because there's no one to interrupt me while i'm doing this so yeah that's that now the next thing that you want to do is go ahead and open up your direction menu and then go to services and then go ahead and call yourself the mobile operation center now guys once the mobile operation center arrives take your lg sorry um uh, whatever card that you want to dupe so you want to take it back onto the back of your moc and press right on the d-pad boom like that and accept the alert and it will you'll be in a black screen for about 10, 10 to 20 seconds once you load back out you will see that your camera angle will be kind of glitched so i'm just waiting for it to be that and then all you need to do is pull out your interaction menu and take the easy way out boom simple as that guys we took the easy way out from there what you will notice is that if you're lucky your moc will be still but guys if you if you aren't lucky if you aren't that that lucky you will see that your moc is kind of glitching out and then it's going to take about a few seconds uh, like 
10 to 20 seconds for it to reset back as you can see now guys i kind of tried to like because i wasn't able to get inside of my mlc and wasn't using my brain so yeah i had to fight off a gang fight right here so yeah uh apologies for that it's kind of uh wasting my time and not efficient use of my time and as you can see the emoji was already open on the other side now next thing that you want to do is park your emoji exactly like that so that like you don't get the animation while driving your car back into the emoji so as you can see right there i parked my moc back up against the wall just like that you guys can do it on any side of the wall so yeah so next thing that you want to do is take your and make sure the blue circle is obviously there next thing that you want to do is drive your uh, car back into the MOC and then press right on d-pad except the alert if there is one if there isn't one that's also cool as you can see boom sorry for that next thing that you will notice is that you will spawn back outside after 10 to 20 seconds next thing that you want to do is return personal vehicle storage now guys once you return personal vehicle storage go ahead and call your mechanic up ow kind of got a cold right now man is what it is uh, next thing that you want to do after that is go ahead and call your fagio this is really important this step is really really important because or else you'll mess up the next part okay so you want to call in your fagio drive your fagio into the back of the moc just like that beautiful now what you will notice is just gonna again take about 20 seconds of a black screen and then you'll spawn back out now once you'll spawn back out go ahead and get out of the um Go get out of the fagio just like that and then go ahead and return it personal vehicle to storage boom now guys that's pretty much it guys for just one dupe now if you guys want to do more cars next thing that you want to do is to rinse and repeat you guys don't have to do it from the beginning this is super easy to actually continue from where we are just next up call in another future shock issy so i'm just going to call in this one so i'll just wait for 20 seconds and wait for the car to arrive obviously guys this is super easy guys you don't have to worry about anything like there's no no timing involved in anything like that so i think it should be easy for all of you guys to hit. now guys if you have any questions make sure to go ahead and comment it down below in the comment section because i do reply to every single comment if that's a question or something and yeah i try my best actually because there are loads of comments on previous videos as well but yeah i try my best to reply so now next thing to uh, repeat this process what you want to do is take your MSC out of the position and put it in an empty space within the casino parking lot right there beautiful now once you park it right there bring your car back over and drive it back in back into the MOC and make sure once you drive it back you get the alert and then accept the alert and you must you must see there is a driving animation with the, the car so it's a really important, important step guys so yeah, again, you want to spawn with this screen, go ahead and pull up your interaction menu and then uh, go ahead and take the easy way out, simple as that, boom. Now, next thing you will see is that this time it took around more time to actually stabilize the MOC as you can see right there, it was stabilizing for a long time and uh, I had to interfere with it a bit. So as you can see, I tried to put it on fire. I tried to separate it and it wasn't doing that. I tried to drive it around. So sometimes it just takes time and sometimes it just takes about two to four minutes to actually stabilize. But if you're lucky, it should be within like 30 seconds. So your MOC should stabilize. So yeah, that's the problem guys. Sometimes you don't want to interfere with it too much. And then I accidentally detached the trailer. So now it was more of a problem to actually reattach the trailer to the MOC. So yeah, unfortunately I had to deal with a lot of consequences for my actions. I shouldn't have gotten inside the MOC and tried to separate it before this. So yeah. So yeah, make sure you don't interfere with it. Uh, let the natural process take place instead of you interfering with the, the MOC. But yeah, next thing that you want to do after the MOC, the, the second MOC like uh, detaches from the original MOC, you want to go ahead and park your MOC in exactly like the previous time. Just make sure that you do not, do not allow the MOC to get a driving animation. So yeah, right there, boom. 
and press around the d-pad to enter now uh, that's pretty much it guys uh, from here basically the simple steps call, in a, call it another fagio just return this vehicle to storage and then call in another fagio get drive it inside and back of the ammo system that's that guys uh, there's nothing more complicated to this method so guys that's pretty much it for this video guys hope you guys did enjoy now for example uh, well, so but i don't have a uh, um, uh, a fagio to actually request for this time around so i just let it be so yeah but anyways if you don't have a fagio your uh car will remain inside of the the duplicate car will be inside of your embassy so you guys don't have to worry about that so that's pretty much it for this video guys if you guys did enjoy today's video make sure to drop a like share subscribe if you have any questions queries or any problems you're facing while doing this method make sure to go ahead and comment it down in the comment section down below with that being said guys hope you guys did enjoy the content subscribe the notification turn on for more videos like this enter the giveaway my name is jira you guys have been so awesome i love you guys with all my heart peace and love baby peace and love